Shalom and welcome to Simon Zatara. This year is entitled, Must I Be Careful Not to Put Ketchup by My Children Plate on Shabbat? I have children on Shabbat on my plate, hot steaming potatoes, meat, and I like it with ketchup. So is that a problem? Shalant is called a davagush, hot steaming piece of food, the meat, the potatoes. And we hold like the marshal that has the potency to actually cook halachically. And I have ketchup. Ketchup is liquidy. So I put that on my meat. So I might cook it. So it's a very interesting shayla. Do I have a problem? Do I have a concern like that? So Rav Moshe says, we have two different sveikot here. This is an Or Haindalad, Simon Haindalad, Halachot of Bishel. And he says, one suffix is, does meat have the potency to cook even after it was removed from the pot to a serving dish to my plate? So some say it's already lost its potency. It's a way off from out of a Klirishon. It's a Klishlishi. I would say, yes, it's a Davakush, but it retains its seed. It doesn't matter if it's been moved so many times. So the Marshal string. He says, and there's another question. Ketchup was cooked. Now ketchup cooled down. And the ketchup's on my plate. So it's a liquid. So there's a whole question. Ain bishal acha Is there cooking after cooking on something that's liquidy? He says, you can argue about whether someone may ask, well, is ketchup even defined as a liquid? And I said, no, it's all defined as a liquid. He says, still, it's a suffix and another suffix. And each suffix is a pretty big homer. It's not like it's a suffix where most postcom are stringent there. It's a suffix over there where most postcom are stringent. It's not really, it's a suffix. And he says, even if the, in theory you may say because of Shabbos was so stringent that even a suffix on a suffix would be stringent, he says, not this one. This is what he calls more of a weaker suffix, sveik, sveik, uh, a double down. And therefore, he says it would be fine. You don't have to be concerned to have the ketchup on the plate and it's going to hit the chill and touch the chill. So even you'll dip the meat into the ketchup. But he says it's not a problem because it's a relatively weak sveik, sveik. Shalom.